Hi there, this is Rocket from the Rockets Podcast. Um, usual, how are you? Uh, you're probably wondering why I did not do or you did not get any uh, podcast this morning in your inbox if you subscribe to my daily podcast. And that is because I choose not to just to uh, give it a little bit rest because what I am finding out is that um, I don't know if there's a lot of people out there that actually have the interest of the podcast that I am doing. So I said, you know what, I'm going to give it a rest and see what happened. But I will, that will not stop me from keep doing it. So what, what is my uh, topic for today? Well, find out. Just give me a second. What I came to mind as my headlines for today's podcast is kids at heart. And I'm not talking about kids. Uh, I am talking about adults. So today, Raul and I went to the barbecue cook-off. It's been a tradition of us. Every year we go through the uh, cook-off because that's only once a year. And they lasted for a few days. And today, you know, we were busy yesterday. So today, I told Rebel, we're going to go and drop one of the dog at the grooming. The other one is at the doctor. So might as well let's do and spend time at the cook-off mid-afternoon. And that's what we did. We had so much fun to begin with. Um, There's a lot of things to see. There are uh, a lot of things to buy. But we are not really into... Uh, buying different stuff except trying out the same barbecue uh, place that we've been tasting for the past say five years now and why is that why we like uh, 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 see awesome because they're awesome and I don't know where they came from but every year they also travel different on different states just to uh, you know, to sell and compete. And they always have, uh, they probably go first place or second place winner every year. So, anywho, so one thing that I um, come to realize while I was looking at the kids, right, is that I never been to any kind of uh, rides when it comes to, like, a uh, fair so I told Ravel, uh, I'm going to go and try this one and see how it feels like. And he said, okay, go ahead. So I was standing in line and all of these kids that was behind me, they were actually cutting the line to the point of like, okay, I'm, if I don't step in, I will not have a spot. And this will be the second time that I'll be waiting. So I decided, you know, uh, enough with allowing all the kids to go ahead of me because I allowed that the first time and I was not able to find a seat. So anyway, so I went in and I was talking to the little girl in front of me and I said, are you excited about this one? And she said, yeah. So the ride started. It's been four times. There is a direction that when it curved, it feels like, I am going to fall. So what I learned after uh, the first turn was just close my eyes and then open it. So throughout the five times of uh, going around, it ended. And I got out of the rides with adrenaline rush. And at the same time, I'm a little shaking. It's like, oh my gosh, this is kind of really fun. And I told Revel, you know, I am really glad that I got to experience that once in my lifetime because why not? That's my thinking, you know. And why do I act like a a child majority of the time? Because uh, I, I have a child type kind of personality. I like to have fun. I like to experience the joy of being able to 
just do what I want to do in a way that it doesn't harm anybody and it doesn't harm me because I don't see anything harm in that one. It is those moments that I come to understand that I don't want to regret the moments that I'm around, that I was not able to do this because most people will talk about in their deathbed, oh, I wish I had done, I wish I had done, I did this, but they never did. And that is the, a regret that I will not allow. So, um, all you know, we had fun. And honestly, you know, the joy, the joy of living, the joy of smiling and laughing, the joy of hugging and talking to people, those means a lot to me because it allows my brain to uh, get stimulated and at the same time, it allows me to feel young in my heart, in my mind. And that's something that I will cherish forever. So this is my podcast for today. And if you have anything, something like that, you know, feel free to share. I would love to hear that. All right. Have a wonderful day and take care. Bye.